time and welcome. So get done with chapter four and out. I decided I'll uh, talk about some of my favorite action movies of all time. Okay? Now, um, there are some action movies that I think, but I haven't seen in, in like either a while or a long time. So they might would make this list, but since I haven't seen in a while or a long time, they will not be in the list, okay? So maybe in the future, if if I do the list again, or uh, make my make the list, if I do if I if I do the video again in the future, they might make it list, okay? And if I do a video uh, talking about uh, action movie that I need to watch uh, uh, again or some more, uh, they will be on that list. Okay, so let me know in the comment section below uh, what your thoughts on the uh, John Wick franchise and what are some of your favorite action movies. Okay, so um, a couple right off the bat that come to my mind uh, when I think of uh, Action movie that I love, all I'm after come to my mind. One of them is Indiana Jones. Okay, um, I grew up, I grew up with the Indiana Jones franchise in my childhood, uh, especially uh, uh, Temple of the Doom, Gallimo, Gallimo. Okay, uh, I was very uh, sad and disappointed. That I did not get to see uh, Kingdom of the Crystal Gold in theaters, but I just uh, went to Walmart and bought it on uh, um, a DVD. Okay, and I watched it. So this is the one, this is the one that I think is underrated. And this is the one that I think the I think the least, not because I hated it. But um, the the last time I I, I, I watched it, I, I liked it. I know a lot of people bad mouth they hate on it, but I, I uh, really do like um, really do like um, um, this this movie. Okay, but it's been a long time since I watched it, so I think the last time I I watched it, I was like a lot younger, so I need to watch it again to see. Uh, in my opinion, opinion of change and stuff, okay? Okay? But I am a big fan of Indian Jones, and, uh, the new one, the new one is, um, you know, you know Indian Jones, The Dial of Destiny, in my most anticipated movie of, of, um, the year. And, the bad thing is, most of the time when, when I have uh, my most anticipated movie of the year, when I come down and I go see it, I, I, I come out of the theater disappointed or let me down or it's a bad movie. It was horrible. So hopefully, uh, any of y'all in the Dial of Destiny, don't let me down, okay? Hopefully, Harrison Ford and Jane Mango won't let me down, okay? Cause that couple of times when I have a most anticipated movie, it let me down. Jane Bond did, No Time to Die. That was my most anticipated movie of that year. And The Last Matrix. Okay? Cause they were, they were my, my anticipated movie of that year. Uh, cause it, yeah. Now, uh, another movie. That it, it's a, that uh, in my favorite uh, action movie. Um, I'm not showing you a couple of them because in um, Game Bond, okay. 
everybody that is a Game Bomb fan, they have like different uh, different Game Bomb movies that that is a favorite. Um, people have different uh, favorite Game Bond actors, some like Sean Connery, Daniel Craig, Roddy Moore, so on and so forth. Okay, I know Golden Eye. Um, is a lot of people favorite. Christina Royale is a lot of people favorite. I think that the Five Who Love Me is my favorite Game Bond movie. Because I'm a, I am a really big fan of action adventure movies. Okay. And I think Roger Moore did a lot of hate when he should not. I like Roger Moore. I think Bond. Okay. Jar, there's a good villain. Uh, the Five Who Love Me theme song. Nobody does it better. It's my favorite uh, Game Bond theme song. Uh, game Bond is, um, uh, Game Bond. Uh, in my favorite uh, movie uh, franchise, I grew up with it in my in my childhood. Goldeneye, that is one of my favorite uh, one of my favorite uh, Game Bond movie. This is this is uh, my Goldeneye. That guy at Walmart when I was uh, in my childhood. Liking a kill. Uh, uh, it's very underrated. Nobody talks about this movie. Um, it, it's very violent, and I think it could have been rated R, the awesome. Okay, but um, I like I like a lot of game bomb movies. I know there's, there's, there's some of them that uh, I would say that it's very bad, and I will give it like an F and stuff. But okay. Um, uh, the first two Matrix, I think it was the best Matrix. A lot of people talk about the the first Matrix, like the only good Matrix movie. But I think Matrix Reloaded is like my favorite Matrix movie. Cause I'm a big fan of the uh, the highway thing and and when they fighting and um. Uh, um, Trinity is, is riding is driving the, uh, the motorcycle, and then Morpheus is fighting on the 18 wheeler, and then and they flight that car and pump over and blow it up. Awesome, okay. Okay, there's a photo matrix, okay. Um, I like True Lies. Okay, so this is the one I, I need to watch a couple more times, but, and, and also this is, this is uh, one of my favorite Arnold Schwarzenegger movies. Okay, one of my favorite action movies. Okay, I like it how he killed the bad guy at the end, and blows him up with a rocket, you know, when he shoots him with a rocket. Okay, like True Lies. Air Force One, one of my favorite uh, uh, Harrison Ford movie, one of my, another one of my favorite action movie. Get off my plane. Okay. Um. Legal Weapon. There, there, there was a, uh, a time period in my life when I was so a sketch with legal weapon franchise, okay? And um, and then I got into the TV show and then they canceled it. And I don't remember but the guy that played Mel new guy that played the Mel Gibson character in the T V show, new one, when he got fired, that's when the T V show T V show got cancelled. You know, they stay on for like, uh, what, what, another another season or something? And then they, 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 they brought in a guy from American Pie. Okay. Uh, I, I, I watched it. And it was pretty funny and good. Until the guy that played uh, 
the new version of Mel Gibson character in the TV show, a series, a TV show, what you want to call it. And when he got, when he quit or fired or whatever, that's when the TV show was over. Okay? Okay? So I like, I like, uh, Little Weapon. Okay? And I am excited. Uh, I don't know if they're still going to do it or not. But like a year or two ago, something I heard that they, they were going to do a, a, a legal weapon 5 and Mel Gibson was rejected. And I hope that it don't let me down. Like, No Time to Die let me down. And um, Matrix Resurrection let me down. Okay? And I hope Indiana Jones, Thou Destiny, don't let me down. Because every time I have an anticipated movie and my number one anticipated movie of the year, it's always let me down. Okay? 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 But, Legal Weapon, like, like I said, by Legal Weapon is, it was a time period in my life where I was so obsessed with Legal Weapon, I, I used to watch it, laugh, head off, like the action in the movie, okay, and whenever it comes out, the uh, Liquid Weapon 5, probably not a Tip Pit movie, okay, of the year. And then, um, um, and then, um, my, my last two movies, um, uh, that, that I can think of, that would be my, uh, some of my favorite action movies of all time, is The Mummy and The Mummy Return, with, uh, Ben Fraser, okay? Okay, I know they're not masterpiece, they're not, uh, war-winning movies, okay. I can stick in the mummy or the mummy return and have fun. God, I hate you, mummy. <laughs> You're on the wrong side of the river. Blue, gold. La -la 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 -la. Hey, if you grew up in the 90s, chances are you watch the mummy or the mummy return. Okay, now, The Mummy, The Tomb of the Dragon Emperor, was a letdown. I didn't, I didn't like it. Now, I can, I can watch it and get some entertainment out of it, but I know it's it, it not as fun and not as enjoyable as the first two, okay? The only thing I didn't like about The, 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 the Mummy Return is how they kill the, uh, they kill uh, the mummy, okay? And, um, uh, the two things I didn't like about the third mummy is it was a different girl that plays his wife and a, a new mummy. I wish the original mummy well, came back and his wife would came back, okay? So, uh, yeah. So, when I was little, I loved watching The Mummy and The Mummy Return. That, 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 was, that was like on the list of movies that I, I used to love watching when I was a kid. My childhood. Okay. Okay. So, so that's it. Um, so thank you for watching, and until next time, and, and before I go, let me know some of your favorite um, action movie or action franchise in the comment section below, and thank you for watching, until next time, thank you.